morning everyone welcome to paris so basically i just got to paris it is 1 p.m december 10th oh my god it's my brother's birthday i have to text him so i just flew to paris from new york i slept pretty much my whole flight but i'm still so tired but i haven't had coffee yet so i just room service coffee and lemon water in my stomach because it's really irritating me right now so i'm gonna have some of this first and then hopefully that wakes me up look at me it's so parisian so i'm in paris to see the jacques mousse show which is insane and i'm so excited and so grateful to be here literally so crazy i don't even like can't even comprehend right now so excited i'm here for three days i'm staying in this beautiful hotel i'll give you guys a little tour this is the bed there's a mirror there's like a little toilet bathroom there and then the full bathroom with a shower is over here tv little station and then that's the desk and this is my view so that was a little tour and then i have some little macaroons here i also came into my room and saw this little gift and no and beautiful flowers. I'm not gonna open it right now, I'll open it later with you guys, but so cute. I'm gonna drink my coffee, get ready, and catch you guys when I have more time to film. Okay, I have to leave like literally right now, but I definitely underpacked in terms of like the weather. It's freezing here, it's way cold in New York. It's like one degree right now, and I brought one light cover jacket and like not warm pants i didn't even bring a sweater like <laughs> so i think i need to do some major shopping which i'm not mad at about but i'm gonna be cold while i shop which i am kind of mad about but i did a little bit of makeup and some lip liner and i just feel like hopefully i look a little bit more awake i'm just gonna wear these peachy den pants and then i'm gonna keep this tank top on as a layer put this shirt on even though I wore it on the plane and it's disgusting and it smells which is actually really embarrassing it really shouldn't smell out of fitting but I don't have anything else like I really didn't pack well and then I'm gonna wear my Uggs like I never know like Paris is like so fancy and Paris is so put together I'm like not cut out for it like I remember last time I came to Paris I just felt so underdressed so not put together uh, like i'm just very casual i feel like and paris is very like everything on point and i'm not that i'm a hot mess all the time but whatever fake it till you make it i also need to get my nails and my toes done because i'm not going to jacques mousse show with this but i'm gonna wait and see what i'm wearing first and then decide i think i might get acrylic because i haven't gone to acrylics in literally over a year i don't really want to ruin my nails but when i'm in paris I gotta go, but I'll see you at the fitting. Okay guys, I'm in the car headed to my fitting. It's very cold. But excited! I feel like my makeup looks crazy. But Rachel is coming on... Bonjour! On Thursday. Uh, not Thursday. Sunday. And she's gonna do my makeup. All right, I just got back from my fitting. I didn't really film because it was very quiet and I, I just didn't want to pull out my camera. You'll just have to wait and see what I'm wearing. It's very cute. I'm really cold. It's 3 p.m. and I want to go shopping and I want to go get something to eat because I'm really hungry. But I wanted to open this little package before I left. So, here's a little note, and it just says, welcome to Paris, Jacques And then we have the bag, and in here, I already know, because they told me at the fitting, is their new bag. Oh my god. Wow. So cute. She is gorgeous. Look at her. Oh my god, she's like the cutest little size the pony hair wow beautiful thank you my camera's gonna die but i'm gonna go for a walk and i'll take you along i'm feeling very tired Hey guys, 
guys, I'm literally the worst. I've been out like all day and I have not vlogged anything. So we're gonna get a lot of hotel content. That's what we're getting in this vlog, I think. Obviously, I'll include the show, but I am so freaking cold. I think my body just didn't adjust to the cold and so I've been cold all day. Anyway, I went for dinner with my friend and had a um, mid burger. Kind of still hungry. Maybe might order room service if there's something good on the menu. I did damage, guys. So much damage. I bought so much. I'm gonna need a suitcase. It's just like, there's no way around it. I bought so many coats because I literally did not pack right. And it was even freezing even then. But I think I'm gonna do a haul tomorrow because this camera is gonna die and I'm tired. But this is one of the coats I got. It's like this gray oversized Burberry trench. It's actually pretty warm. It's cute. I like how the shoulder pads come out of it. But yeah, I'm out of it. I'm really tired. Good morning, everyone. Hey, it's the next day. I slept horribly. Literally slept at like 3.30 a.m. I was in bed at like... 11 maybe earlier like 10 i don't know why i just got like upset and like just couldn't sleep and now it is 11 30 which i'm so pissed about because i had a whole schedule and like it would have been done by now and i have so much i want to do today yeah we're a little a lot behind schedule but i'm gonna go for a walk and go get a coffee and i want to pick up a bunch of juices from this place called wild and moon it's like um a vegan cafe type situation restaurant to go type spot in Paris so I'm gonna go there but I'm gonna wash my face first I look crazy I'm so puffy like because I didn't sleep oh this is so annoying and then I'm gonna come back here there's a sauna and a gym here and I want to use them I wanted to use them yesterday but they close, or this, at least the sauna closes at 7, so I want to come back here because it's freezing and drink my juice and read in the sauna. That just sounds amazing to me. I need to go get my nails done. I totally forgot. And go to Sephora. And then I also have to go buy a suitcase because, 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 because... Because I bought so much shit when I went shopping. And there was still some more stores I wanted to go to. But that is definitely not a priority. And I need a suitcase. But I'm not going to have time to get one to... Oh wait, I totally would have time. Oh, I keep thinking I leave tomorrow. I don't leave tomorrow, actually. I leave... Okay, wait. I don't leave tomorrow. The show is tomorrow. So technically, I have a couple hours after the show. I think I'll be back here around 3. And then I'm gonna get help, get, have my friend Rachel help me. We we'll eat dinner around like eight, probably. Okay, um, I just did a little makeup basics and oh, I didn't put blush on. I wanna put blush on. And I decided I'm gonna go get juices and then I think I'm gonna go attempt to find, find a nail salon that has room, which might be kind of hard because it's a Sunday. And I don't know. I don't know how busy things are in Paris, but. Um, I just feel like it might be kind of hard, so I'm gonna try though. I'm so tired guys like my eyes are shutting. I need coffee immediately Basically, I've decided that 
I'm not gonna get my nails done first of all because everything is closed today because it's Sunday and so all the nail salons are closed at least most of them are so the ones that are open are probably full so I just bought my own nail polish at Sephora I also got a nail kit so <laughs> I can give myself a mani pedi this is the color I had I originally wanted to do okay this chair is like really making a lot of noises I originally wanted to do like a dark brown color but they didn't have really what I wanted so I got this dark green because I'm gonna be wearing that bright green bag and then my outfit is like beige I went to the juice place got a coffee but that shit was leaking everywhere it was like spilling all over my gloves and I just had to throw it out so yeah and then I went to Sephora so I got some eyebrow clippers because I wanted to trim my eyebrows and then I went to a different coffee shop called uh, Le Pain Quotidien and I got a croissant because again all the like classic like I never know how to like respond to doors you know I literally got woken up today because the cleaning ladies anyway and I went to the pain quotidien and I got ginger carrot sweet potato soup which looks really fire so I'm excited to drink that and I just got a coffee and a croissant because yeah like i said the bakeries are closed but i'm gonna go tomorrow probably to the regular bakeries but basically what i have to want to do is sauna and work out because i also need to shoot content basically what i want to shoot today is the isabelle macron bag which i think i'm going to do on this couch area and then i want to do i need to do the marikimo stories mm. this is busting wow and like i can't even think I also need to do some work, so, yeah, anyway, okay, bye. Okay, I'm in the sauna. It's f***ing hot. There's nobody in here, which is nice. It's a really nice sauna, too. It's pretty big. And I'm gonna try and do this for, like, 30 minutes, or two sessions of 15. Oh, I have my book. Definitely need some water. It's really hot. <laughs> but it feels so good. So, yeah, I'm gonna stay in here. And then the gym looks really nice too, so I think I'm going to use that after. So, okay. Alright, um, hey guys. It is like 9 o'clock and I just had my dinner. I ordered room service, so I'll insert a little clip of what it was. It was actually really good. I'm trying out this Dr. Jart face mask, or cryo face mask. And I thought we would try it out together because it looks pretty crazy. So, first step... Okay, so we start by putting on the hyaluronic, hyaluron, hyri, oh god, hyaluronic acid moisturizer. Oh my god, I can't say it. I swear to god, if this makes you break out, I'm gonna scream. That is on. And then we put the mask on top of it. And then leave this on for like 40 minutes. I never know which way it's supposed to go on my face. Look like Squidward. All right, keeping this on for 40 minutes. And then I'm gonna go to bed. I look insane, bye. Good morning, everyone. It is show day. I got literally two hours of sleep. I don't know how I'm alive right now, but I ordered coffee and I drank that. So that's probably why, and I'm watching White Lotus. I literally was up to like 4 a.m. last night. Don't don't ask me how or why. But I'm going to do my skincare and Rachel's gonna be here in like probably like 40 minutes. I don't know what to do with my hair. I'm just like I'm not a big like hair person. Mainly because I don't really know how to do it. So I'm like not really sure what I should do. I might just leave it down and put some product in it. That's chill, but then I also like don't want to be like hair is so important and looking like usually my hair does not look put together. I was also thinking I could put it in like like a mid pony. I'm not sure. And I also thought like maybe straightened would be sleek. But I honestly like my hair naturally. I think it looks pretty good and I like a little volume and texture but at the same time I don't know it would make my life a lot easier if I just left it down I think 
think I might just do lead it down or maybe do like a middle part pony. I don't know, we'll see. But I'm gonna just do some base makeup, I think, before Rachel gets here because I need to shoot that Isabelle Macron bag because I never did it. So we're gonna try and do that today, this morning. And I need to order some breakfast before they close. But yeah, I'm very excited. It's gonna be a great day. Yay. Hey guys, so Rachel's here, my makeup artist. Hello. She just got here, about to start doing my makeup. Hello everyone. <laughs> Welcome to Get Ready with Ruby and Rachel. Doing her makeup. makeup by Rachel. <laughs> I'm a makeup artist for one day. She's going to the Jack Moose show. Jack so. Moose. Okay. Jack Moose. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we have T minus an hour, basically an hour. So we're gonna try and do magic. We got this. I know what we're doing. You look so pretty. I cannot believe it. Look how pretty she looks. Thank you. My little Ruby Lynn. Final <laughs> summer Fridays on the lit. And um, showtime, baby. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, bye. Freaking for the weekend, we've been breaking borders, leaving speeches. Haters talk about all us, leaving teethless. Women I have slaughtered cause they decent. I'm coming for their daughters, leave them decent. Peach, you was all up in the creases. You don't hang with ballers, said we beefing. If I don't get the call, then we need. 